What is going on guys, this is Game with Red, and I am here to bring you the Fall Dashboard Preview for October 2019. This is the new look of it on the Xbox One. Uh, I am on the Xbox One X, if you're on the S or the uh, original X when this rolls out. If this rolls out, this will be what you'll be looking at. Now I say if, because this time Microsoft's handling things a little bit differently. Uh, and what do I mean by that? Okay, here we go. Microsoft decided they needed more user feedback to see which apps people are using most, which configuration they're using most. So they're actually put out three. Well, they put out two dashes, let's be real. They put out an, uh, an A, a B, and a C. Now, what you're seeing here is I have A, which is, uh, you can tell it's A because I have the game pass right on the front page here. And if you remember before, you'd have like the top would be the store. Now you have Game Pass here, Mixer here, the stores right here, and your community tabs are here, which I'll, I'll click into those in a second, as well as, you know, your games and all the other stuff, feeds. Um, so B would look different, and C is actually nothing. They did nothing, they left it just the way it is, just to see how it works. And uh, so if you're in the group and you happen to get A, B, or C, if you get C, you pretty much get shafted. So... Uh, you may get this dash, you may not, and uh, I usually always do the dash updates, so here we go. As you can see, my recently played games are right here. My games and apps is now here. I mean, you can still do the guy that's the same up here. You got your, you know, communication, and you got all your settings and everything where they're supposed to be. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, but now, this one, I'm not sure how I feel about it. You press down for your Game Pass mixer. You go down one, there's your store right there, easy to access. Here's your deals, new games. You get in. It, it flows pretty smooth, I guess. Um, it still has a little bit of an opening, but, you know, it's a quicker way to get to this. Um, at least from the from the last dash. And then you got your community tab, which if you're any groups or uh, any of that stuff and you want to use them, you can actually adjust and change all these as well. You got your mixer here. Um, these are games I had actually pinned, so you can still do your pins, you can still go in, say you don't want this here anymore, you hit the, this, you can go up and down with it now, you can move it here, you can actually, um, you know, take it out, and that's pretty much it. Before you could actually, um, just add it or, or leave it, so now you have the option to do it quickly, um, at least I, I think, I'm, tr I'm not... I didn't mess with these too much, so I could be wrong. Don't don't count on it. But basically, this is where your Xbox Gold and Deals is down here now. Um, your pins are all here, which uh, that your tips and features. And then right here is where you can add more. Like I said, um, you, you you can add all the normal stuff. So not a whole lot has really changed. Um, like I said, the main thing is instead of everything being on the top now, you you got it right here. Your Game Pass, your Mixer, your Store. And your games so I mean it's pretty easy to get into your your games here um, you know not really much I can say but uh, that's the new group a dashboard if you like it uh, you have any questions comments you how you feel about it let me know down in the comments below and uh, yeah I appreciate watching the video you can like it and if you're not a subscriber, subscribe if it helped you. If you're interested to see more, I do video gaming stuff and everything else. But if not, uh, if you could just like it, I'd appreciate it if uh, you found some value in it. All right, guys, that's it. That was just a quick overview of it. Have a good night.